Good morning, team. How's it going? How you feeling? I hope you're doing good. I hope you have a good feeling in your heart, a smile on your face, and a good attitude today. And if that's the case, please pass that on and help someone else feel just as good as you are because we all need a little bit more unity and a lot more love. In this video, I'm going to do the one mod that they tell you you should not do on an E38. Muffler delete time, baby. So, my little boy is becoming a man. Let's do this. No muffler delete video in the history of YouTube videos has ever been completed without a before and after. So, let's do that. Working man, if you take my spot, oh dude. You got lucky. You got lucky your car was made in Japan where the fuel tank opening is on the opposite side of mine. I don't know what that means actually. The thing about removing the mufflers on an E38 is that well it's it's just frowned upon. <laughs> Like, like drawing sunglasses on the Mona Lisa. I think it look cool. I may even hang it up on my house. But if I invite company over, I might take it down. Cause I don't want this screen. But I mean, what's the alternative, right? Am I gonna go get like a $500 exhaust system? cheap for doing it this way well, yeah I, I probably have but who cares it sounds good it sounds good do what you love right and at the end of the day it ain't dumb if it sounds good and you can't see it because that's the other thing you can't really see the exhaust tips on this car it's all about the sound for me. And this car right now is like a supermodel. Beautiful, classy, just, just perfect. It is perfect. And they say you cannot improve on perfection. And to that I say, watch me. I just realized every car in here has a V8. I dare you to tell me that that doesn't sound better than it did. I dare you to tell me that's not a rumble that you enjoy. Granted, this is not gonna be everybody's cup of tea and I understand that. But that is not annoying at all. That is not a bad rumble. That is not, I mean, the cabin of this car does so much to keep the driver completely isolated from the outside world sounds are just not coming in through here and i do have the windows up right now even to those with higher sensibilities this is nice um just like anything it's still it's still so reserved when you treat it like a nice executive car, like the nice executive car that it is. It's not 
going to be an AMG C63. It's not a Mercedes in that way. No, it's much more understated. We're gonna see what it sounds like with the windows down. which in this car on the streets is about 1500 RPM. It's almost gone. It almost disappears completely. Now it's time to get on the freeway. So we'll see what that feels like because the way that I drive this car on the streets, I'll have it on drive, which is your everyday, um, no frills, no thrills. And I usually drive it like this very slow um, basically gas saver mode when I get on the freeway I always put it on sport mode so let's just see what that sounds like Understated. I'm enjoying it. I like it. <laughs> I'm doing 80 miles an hour right now, and we're cruising at 2,500 RPM, and it's almost as quiet as when I had the mufflers. M62 TU. Such a balanced engine that you cannot hear it running at 80 miles an hour. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for sticking around to the very end of the video. I appreciate you wholeheartedly as always. If you like the video, please give it a share, give it a like, give it a thumbs up. And uh, again, thank you. That's all I can say. Thank you for receiving this video so well. My channel has been doing amazingly great. So it's all thanks to you. And um, yeah, much love. Be good to each other. Those are my pads squeaking. And I'll see you 